Hello guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel, it's your boy here. Today I'm bringing you a money tutorial on Farming Simulator 2015. Let's go. Right, uh, what we want to do straight away is just reset everything. So let's go ahead and do that. Just press the left analog in and then you get the, the little menu pop up. Just reset everything. Alright, once you've done that, just go ahead and hop into a bigger tractor. Let's go ahead and buy a chainsaw. Any will do. They're all exactly the same. And what we'll do is, we'll head over to the, I think it's the uh, northwest bit. Yeah, near the mill pond. So, let's go. All we need to do first is make a bit of money. Uh, we need to chop down about three, four trees in order to help us into getting the Scorpion King. So that we will just dedicate some time to chopping down trees as that's the best way to make money in this game. So let me go ahead and skip till I'm there. See you guys back in a sec. Right guys, now that we're here, what we want to be doing is cutting down the one nearest to the pond. So we'll go ahead and cut down these two here. Uh, let's rotate it so we get the root. Go as low as you can to avoid the stumps getting in the way. Right, let's get into the tractor. What we'll do is push the tree directly into the pond. Just drive into it, it should stop pushing it. Once you drop it in there, you should get about 3,000 for the tree. Oh, just be careful not to push yourself in there with it. If you need to adjust the angle, then do so by just reversing back there we go so we got 3700 all we'll do is we'll do another tree and then yeah we'll do another two trees just to be safe there we go let's push that one in there go ahead and go back around if you need to like i said sometimes you need to just adjust the angle to make things easier Be careful not to go into the pond like I almost did just there. Right, next one. Let's do these one here. I was going to say two, but I think we only need one more so we won't bother with that one. Actually, we do another one. So we'll do four trees in total. So I'll cut down four trees in total. And then just push them into the, the pond. Let's 
it. Right, let's go ahead and go back around it. We'll do another tree just to be safe and to give us enough time as because as we use vehicles it um, tends to decrease the amount of money so what we'll do is we'll cut this one down This one seems to be a bit more difficult. Let's try. It. Let's try a different angle and see if we can get it to budge. If not, we won't bother with it. Uh, we should have enough. Uh, right, there we go. Just turn it to the side if you have any issues. Just push it slowly into it. jammed again. Reverse back, full speed into it. Let's go more into the middle. Hopefully we don't get stuck. Oh, oh, there we go. Right. All we want to do now, we've got 27 grand. So, what we do now is, uh, as we've reset everything, we want to go ahead and just sell everything directly to the to the garage as you get 20% more for selling it direct than you would if you sell it over the website so let's go ahead and sell everything so I'll show you the first one and then I'll skip and just sell all of them that I've done and then we can go ahead and buy the Scorpion King and I'll show you the next bit Go ahead and go over to garage and just sell everything. So let's go over the little bridge. Make sure you sell all of the attachments as well. So sell your weights and your trailers, everything like that. You don't need it, you can always buy them back once you've made quite a bit of money right let's go ahead and sell that and there we go that's the first one done what we need to do now is so let's go ahead and hook this up let's grab one of the weights as well so when we do that Right guys, once you've sold your last one, 
be left with about 230 I think no yeah near enough 230 K which is enough to do the next bit we need to do what we'll do is go to, over here to the cash point and take out the rest of the loan so let's go ahead and do that so check finances and just spam X and borrow the full amount so now we've got around 328 grand all we do is uh, let's go ahead go onto the website equipment and buy yourself the scorpion king let's go ahead and do that let's jump right into it what we do is head over to the mill pond again I'll see you guys there in a second Right guys, once you've gotten over here to the mill pond, what you want to do is, if you haven't sold four trees at the start, uh, push them into the pond, I mean, then you'll have slightly a bit less money than I did, so it doesn't matter, you can do the same thing as I'm about to do now, or you can skip and do the next step, uh, which I'll show you, so I'm just going to show you, if you haven't got enough money, oh, oh, let me tip it over, no, 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 no. what we want to do is just uh, adjust uh, the cut length to about five meters six meters and go ahead drag it over to the, to the mill pond just stop there ooh, ooh, ooh. nearly went into the pond that's not what we were supposed to do ooh. hold on hold on come on out you get went back to the beginning right, let me show you that again I do apologize for the mistake <laughs> as you know mistakes happen all right let's try that again go ahead and cut the tree right, lift it out there we go let's drag it over to this side Like I said, you want to adjust your cut lengths to about 6 meters so that you get nice clean cuts. Right, a bit more. Right, let's start cutting it. As you can see, that uh, that was a bit too far in front. Do you want to drop into the, the pond again? Just go ahead and push it in if you need to. Uh, that little bit there doesn't really matter once you've got uh, over well you only need 7,000 so once you've got 7,000 go ahead and go to the shop go over to placeables and buy yourself a fir tree so we'll go ahead and put it in this area here and it should be right in front of us there we go which it is what we want to do is repeat the same process so I'll just go ahead and cut it down. And just drag it to the mill pond again. The difference between these ones and the other ones that are already planted is that these ones are slightly bigger and they give you more money. So go ahead and cut them down as you will see. You get about six grand for each cut, I think, sometimes seven. Yeah, these ones seems to be six grand then as the cuts get smaller you get less but that's how you make money really you just keep planting fir trees and cutting them once you've done that you will have quite a fair bit of amount of money as you can see we already got 42k uh, from cutting down two trees one tree really the other one was just a small change uh, just go ahead repeat it keep going to placeables 
Get yourself another fir tree. Plant it there. Go ahead, cut it down again. Uh, let's go ahead and rotate it. Drag it back to the pond again. Not too far so you don't drop in like I did the first time. <laughs> I cut them down again. Right, as you can see, now we've got 60k. So just keep rinsing and repeating. Just be warned that um, when you're doing this, you're basically uh, killing the, the point of the game where you have to try and obviously get rich. But it does help. I mean, money doesn't fall out of the sky in this game. So uh, it's very slow on money progress. So it, it does help quite a lot if you do this to start off with. And then obviously you can start buying. Uh, there are missions. Um, over on these little posts over here that you can do um, usually there are delivery missions or there are I think uh, grass cutting missions so I do advise to do them because as you, the more you do the more obviously the money starts going up for them so you do tend to get quite a bit of money so at the moment this one we've got a heart a transport one where we've got to try and transport some canola which gives you 12,000 which is not bad it's really good actually I think that's the highest one I've ever seen um, on this uh, but there you go that's how you start it off and make yourself some money and please don't waste money on on buying any of the other forestry equipment uh, do not buy the buffalo uh, obviously you want to get yourself the the stomp thing to get rid of the tree stumps so you will need to buy that and get yourself a, a good tractor one of the beginning ones you can always buy them back and then obviously get yourself a timber runner once you've deforested the area and then get yourself a truck and then like that you can go all over and just cut them down all right guys hope you enjoyed this tutorial and i'll see you guys in the next video thanks for watching make sure you hit the like button and subscribe if you already haven't see you guys later